<coughs> Whoa, that was weird. Hi, I'm Torvosaurus, and welcome to the late Jurassic period 144 million years ago. You say my name, Torvosaurus. It means savage lizard. <coughs> Gee, what is going on with my roar box? I'm a theropod, which means I walk on two legs and I eat meat. A meat eater is called a carnivore. I am the largest meat eater in these parts. I'm one of the biggest theropods ever, over 10 meters long. And these thumb claws, they help me hunt for food. I'm from what's now known as the Midwestern United States. Yeehaw! Ooh, 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 ooh. <sighs> <clears throat> me, 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 me. All me. That's better. Now let me try a good one. <laughs> Superhero High is pleased to announce the hero of the month is Katana. Katana knows how to slice and dice. I love her creative style. <laughs> Fierce fashion. Katana always lends the hand of the helping. Help! <laughs> Skills, style, and selflessness. Katana, Hero of the Month. Now that's what I call fresh air on the open range. My name is Ineosaurus. That's i ne o -saurus. It means buffalo lizard. Did you know that I'm from what is now known as Montana? Only here, nowhere else in the world. You know, there's more to the late Cretaceous period than trees and stinky flowers. I'm a ceratopsid. That means I'm a herbivore. I eat plants. And I have a beak. And we have these big curved horns on our noses. Looks like a big bottle opener, doesn't it? Too bad there's no such thing as bottles in the late Cretaceous period. And I live in a big herd, which is great if there are any big dinos around that might be a threat. Just one of us might not be enough to scare off a big gobbler dino, even though we're six meters long and weigh two tons. But put us all together, and there is safety in numbers. And hey, if that doesn't work, there's always the old stampede! Superhero High is pleased to announce the hero of the month is Hawk Girl. High five! For her work as head hall monitor, her position in the hall <laughs> monitor's hall of fame is secured. Mm -hmm. And no talking in the library. One demerit. I suppose the rules apply to everyone. As a member of the Junior Detective Society of Metropolis, Hawk Girl helps maintain peace and justice. Feline. Hmm. I know. The perp is lion mane. Hawk Girl is a seriously fly friend. Happy birthday, Bumblebee! Happy you did all this for me? Rule number 28 of friendship, never forget a birthday. And that's why Hawk Girl is Hero of the Month. Ah, beautiful view, isn't it? Hi, I'm Pteranodon. You say it. 
Pteranodon, and it means winged and toothless. That's right. In my beak, I have no teeth. Do you want to know a secret? Hey, Pteranodon, I'm going to the picnic now. Oh, the dino picnic. Really? Do you think I can come? Yeah, sure. Every dino can. Remember that secret I want to tell you? Well, the secret is that I'm not a... So, okay. Let's go. I'm from what is now Kansas, in the USA. But that's not the secret. Secret? I love secrets. I have hollow bones to make me light, and I have a huge wingspan, about 10 meters wide. That's as wide as a hand glider. That's not a secret, Pteranodon. Okay, fine. Do you want to know my secret? Well, here it is. I'm not a dinosaur. <laughs> That's right. I'm not a dino at all. I'm a flying reptile. I'm related to the dinosaurs, but not actually one myself. I guess I can't come to the dinosaur picnic now. By the way, dinosaur means great lizard. As far as I'm concerned, it also means friend. Yippee! <laughs> Thanks, T-Rex. You're the best. My best friend and I are going on a picnic. See you later. Superhero High is pleased to announce the hero of the month is Poison Ivy. Ivy straight up rescued me. I'm not a falling thief. I'll save you. Bad Chompy. Well, I won't beat around the bush. Red's a lifesaver. Ah, I hate needles. Ah! No, Spike, no. Ivy got me out of a prickly situation. Ow! Help! Don't make me prune you. Yeah! Ralph, I'm not angry. I'm just disappointed. Oh, hi! Nothing suspicious happening here. Me? Hero of the month? That's so unexpected. Poison Ivy, Hero of the Month. I'm Corythosaurus. That's Cor, Rytho, Saurus. Do you know what that means? Helmet lizard. It's because of this thing on my head. My herd and I use them to make amazing sounds. Listen. <laughs> okay, that's not exactly what it's supposed to sound like. It must be all the dust from the volcanoes over there. Wow, what a sound! That's awesome! How come I can't make a big sound? Why can't I do it? Did you hear that? It's my herd calling. I'm gonna answer them if it's the last thing I do. <laughs> what am I doing wrong? There's my herd. I wonder if they want to play with me. Hey guys, what do you say we play a game of... Whoa! <coughs> Did you hear that? <coughs> Did you? Oh joy! I wonder if they heard it. <coughs> Oops, sorry to wake you. I was just so excited that I finally made the same sound as you guys. I'll be quieter. Superhero High is pleased to announce the hero of the month is Frost. Yeah! Oh! Frost is wicked smart. Circumference equals the diameter multiplied by pi, which is approximately 3.14159. She has really cool powers. Chill out, kid. <laughs> 535-8979-3238. When it comes to fighting supervillains, she never gets cold feet. <laughs> 9937510. Frost, Hero of the Month.
Hi, everyone. I'm a woolly mammoth. You can call me Wooly. My name says it all. I'm big, I'm fuzzy, and I'm lost. I mean, really. How can I find my herd if everything is covered in snow? Welcome to the Ice Age. 100,000 years ago, I guess. Eep. Hey, what's the big deal? <laughs> my long shaggy hair and my thick layer of underwool keeps me dry and warm. So throwing snowballs won't do anything! Plus, I have special skin which oils up the hair to make me even warmer. Eep. Aha! I have an idea. Mmm. I use my super long tusk to shovel the snow to uncover this yummy grass. How will I ever be able to eat it all by myself? Ha ha ha. I'm a little bigger than the biggest elephant, but my ears are much smaller than an elephant's. I come from the cold northern part of the world where scientists have found entire woolly mammoths, hair and everything, frozen in the ice. People usually get mixed up and think I'm a dinosaur, but I'm really an ice age animal. Eep! Okay, wise guy. <laughs> He got me all right, but at least he knows where the herd is. I thought you knew where they were. <laughs> <laughs>